Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the views so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoes. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another beer review. Uh, we're going to review a Magnify Brewing beer today. It's been a while since we've had one of these, uh, but my buddy Dave sent me a box of beer and a mag couple Magnify beers were in there. So um, this is solid gold, good times. This is an 8.5% alcohol by volume. Uh, do they call this a double IPA? Yeah, it doesn't. It just says double dry hop. I think it's double IPA, right? 8.5%. Uh, it says double dry hopped with Nelson Sauvin hops. I'm a huge Nelson fan. Um, I love me some Nelson hops. Uh, Magnify is Fairfield, New Jersey. This was canned on May 9th. So we are time of recording 10 days old. Um, I'm actually interested to drink this beer because Darwin recently reviewed a Magnify beer and said it was a drain pour because it was super astringent with the hops. I haven't had that experience with Magnify beers. I mean, they brew some hoppy beers, but nothing to where I was wanting to pour it out because it was offensive. So um, I'm interested to see what this beer is like. I would say his, <laughs> I would say his palate is much more refined than mine. So we all like different stuff. Uh, we're using our Magnify proper glassware that Dave also gave me a while back because beer tastes better in proper glassware. Uh, that's a like a golden yellow hazy color, super hazy finger of off-white head, super marshmallowy. Uh, it looks awesome. Looks like a New England style beer. So I'm also interested. I haven't had a beer with Nelson in a, in a while, and I've also been on a kick of I've been drinking West Coast beer. So um, wondering what this is going to be like. So let's go ahead and shove our nose in it. This actually smells pretty malty for only being 10 days in the can. That could be like a sweetness from the Nelson hops, like that kind of vinous thing, but it's pretty like bready sweet. But this also has like that yeasty kind of like chalky aroma. It is vinous though. It's like that green grape thing, but it's pretty crazy. Like this smell, it's only been in the can for 10 days. It kind of smells like an older beer. Nelson hops do that though. They can get funky and just do weird things. I I'm guessing that's what that is. It's super earthy too uh, that you get from Nelson, like kind of dusty, dirty. I don't want to say it smells like dirt, but it smells pretty dirty. Maybe it, maybe that's a little bit of booziness that I'm smelling. By the way, so it says second anniversary. I don't know. I thought Magnify was older than two years. Maybe this is their second anniversary of canning beers. I'm not sure. I'll have to look that up. I probably should have done that. <laughs> I should have done that before we started this review. I'm actually really interested to see what this tastes like because it's the aroma's throwing me off. So, Dave, cheers. Thank you, sir. It tastes nothing like it smells. That's so crazy. This is hoppy AF, actually. It's double dry hop. Of course, it's going to be right. I mean, if you like Nelson. This is a Nelson bomb, um, but there's a good, like, it's, first of all, it's crazy dry, bone dry, um, and middle of your tongue to the finish of that, it's pretty intense with, a, I don't want to say it's astringent, but it's biting, it's digging at your tongue, it's really, really hoppy. Um, astringency to me is like kind of a burn, this doesn't have a burn, it's just intensely hoppy, um, but it's crazy, like, white grape juice from the front of your tongue to the middle, and then you get that intense it's not citrus pithiness but it's just i don't know what that flavor is it's just aggressively biting at your tongue leaving like what i would perceive as bitterness but it doesn't taste like citrus bitterness it just tastes like hot bitterness it just tastes like in your face <laughs> crazy I, I i honestly i don't know what that flavor is that i'm tasting it is though this is bone dry which is crazy because this is almost nine percent and it makes you want to keep drinking just because it's so drying uh, which gets you in trouble because a 16 ounce can of this and you'll be feeling real nice. It's I, the nose. The nose is really weird. It smells like a malty beer and there's a good amount of like bready kind of maltiness that is underneath all that crazy aggressive hop matter <laughs> that I'm tasting. I, I wish I could figure out what that flavor is. Um, so it's not the most balanced beer. It's there, but it's not balancing it out. Um, as much as it probably could, but again, it's probably because they've used so much hops in this beer. Um, if you like Nelson, you will like this. Is it the like most well-made Nelson beer, best tasting Nelson beer I've ever had? No. Um, if you like aggressive hop forwardness in a beer, you will like this. 
Um, if you're sensitive to that, you probably won't like it as much. For me, I kind of wish, I, I never thought I would hear myself say this in a beer review, I kind of wish it was, there was more of like that malt backbone there to kind of balance out how aggressive it is. I just think it would kind of bring the Nelson out more. Um, it's definitely there, but again, just talking, my tongue is so dry, it's crazy. It makes me want to chug this, but if I chug this, I'm going to be fucking hammered. So, um, for me, this is like in that 91 range. I think it's really good. I just think it could have been better. And something like this, maybe a month in the can to let that kind of hop aggressiveness die out. Maybe it might be a lot better. Um, this was the only can of this that I got. So I want to drink it now, 10 days in the can. It's still crazy aggressive, but time might do this a little bit of good. I'm not sure. So, um, I don't know when this is going to go up, but maybe by the time it does, It'll have sat in the can a little bit longer, and people who have drank it more than 10 days old will be able to comment and let us know. But yeah, I'm gonna go 91. So that's solid gold, good times from Magnify, their second anniversary ale. Uh, Dave, thanks, thanks again for sending that one. And if any of you guys have had this, leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought about it. Um, and yeah, that's it. I'm out of here. As always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you very soon. Cheers. Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoes.